Yo, brother, I'm saying to you, they're doing it every day to me. Imagine being you, being me, getting this. Okay. It's a nightmare. You shouldn't give people your address. No one's, I'm famous, darling. A rich, darling. Booyah, oh, out of here. So, you see what I've got to deal with? And then he's trying to run his mouth and say you shouldn't give people your address and this and that. Are you crazy? I'm having to argue because someone has ordered food to my yard, to my address. And there's no way that they can track it because it's Uber Eats. So, well, there you go. I'll be giving the police the information, darling, because this video is recorded and everything's recorded. So this is what triggers me, darling, you know, and what, what can I do? I'm not going to end my life every fucking minute. Do you know what I mean? Yesterday, police, I weren't even on live and shit happens. You know, what can I do? I'm a famous bitch. Move me into a fucking penthouse. I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. <sighs> but I still live in Chelsea, darling. I am not leaving my block. You think anyone's going to run me out my yard? Are you mad? Dusty <sighs> <sighs> but can you imagine the food? I don't even feel hungry now. I'm fasting anyway. <sighs> poor neighbours, what about me? What about poor Chelsea? Oh, never mind the neighbours, what about me? What about poor Chelsea? What about me? Huh? What have I done? I've gone live in my house. I'm doing my job. I'm number 12 in the UK leaderboard. Sister's trying to make some peas. Not what time it is. This is my job. I'm not on benefits. I have to pay my rent, council tax, fucking everything. My it's bad enough the benefits trying to scam me as it is, you know? And then feeling guilty, saying that, oh, we might be able to help you with your rent because we know I'd be able to help you with your rent because we know I'd be able to help you with your rent because we know I'd be able to help you with your rent because we know cares anyways because I don't need help do I because I make enough money on TikTok so you are so no one cares about your fucking 20% off or whatever oh, but maybe you know in time I will but oh, they're sending food that's not been paid for oh I don't know Oh, is that one paid for? I've just realised. Well, he never gave it me. Well, this is the thing. I'm so used to it not being paid for that, you know, I've just lost my mind. It's probably a dusty pork, come on. I only eat margarita with pineapple and sweet corn and jalapeno peppers. Um. But I'm gonna eat my pasta bake. Alexa, continue the music. What's up, people? Welcome back to another video. And what I just witnessed was half mayhem, half stupidity. Let me explain. Half mayhem in. It gets views when Chelsea Lee Art gets riled up. A lot of people come in and they want to watch. They want to see what happens next. They want to know what she's going to say next. They want to know what action she's going to take next. So she went to her door, of course, and it was Uber Eats. Now, if I was in her position, it's Uber Eats. I'm going to take whatever it is. And if I like how it looks, if I like how it smells, if I like how it tastes, I'm going to eat it. Because one thing you got to do when it comes to online stuff, when you are a creator or an influencer, or maybe you're both creator and influencer, maybe you educate, maybe you entertain, maybe you educate and entertain, maybe you just piss people off, who knows? But one thing you got to learn and understand is that you got to roll with the punches or 
in this specific situation, you gotta roll with a free fool, man. You gotta learn how to, you know, navigate your environment because that's literally what the definition of intelligence is the ability to navigate your environment well and with this chelsea art really isn't uh, navigating her environment well i say this because okay you get you get knocks on your door all the time i get it people try and send food to your door all the time whether or not it's paid for i don't know one thing i would do if i was in her position is ask but like hey is is this food paid for and if they're like, yeah, it, it, it is, I'm like, thank you. Because I'm not gonna let the trolls win. Because the trolls want her to be out of pocket. They want her to show her emotions. They want her to get riled up. They want her to get pissed off. They want her to do something she shouldn't be doing so that she gets put back in the bing again. And I'm sure CLA doesn't want that to happen. So, hey, if they already know where your council flat is, they know your door number, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Roll with it. Take the free food if it's free. If it's not free, explain like, listen, I'm a influencer. People do this all the time. Can you maybe just say to the, the business, if the food isn't paid for, please don't try and deliver it here because I'm not going to pay for it. But hey, if, if it is paid for, I am definitely going to be eating it. Well, that's just my opinion, my two cents. You guys tell me yours. I really love to hear what you think, how you feel. Um, was her reaction okay? Was it out of pocket? Was uh, the reaction, did you want her to tone it down? Did you want to bring the reaction up? You know, the engagement up? How do you feel? Was this a setup? Is she doing this for views? Because sometimes I kind of think like that. I don't know. Maybe she's on the next level. And, you know, she's she's doing this to her own self. Because some creators do that. I'm not saying that she is doing it or she isn't doing it. Because I don't know. But some creators do do that. But, hey, we shall see what happens in time. Guys, tell me your opinion. Like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. Because it does really help me out with the algorithm. And I really do appreciate it. And I will be back with another video. Take care.